Israeli Air Force's Squadron 100, otherwise known as the Flying Camels, is responsible for gathering intelligence on enemy targets and ensuring minimal collateral damage during an attack. The Jerusalem Post joined the Flying Camels during a routine reconnaissance flight over Gaza. These planes that are with the squadron that we flew on today uh, carry a system that is an electro-optical system that allows it to see to unbelievable resolutions, to gather intelligence on Israel's various different enemies, and to be able to create target banks before conflicts. At the same time, it enables the Air Force to accompany ground operations to provide assistance from the air, air support, for various operations that the IDF participates in on the ground, whether it's in Gaza, Lebanon, or any other front for uh, Israel. The system can see to, resol to resolutions of a human being, uh, even to, to see whether it's a child or a grown-up. And uh, using this ability, we, we are able to, to understand whether the person is involved, whether he's uh, in the right age, whether he's whatever uh, characteristics he has. And then you hear after Operation Cast Lead, for example, that Israel or the Army, the IDF, the Air Force is accused of war crimes, crimes against humanity by the Goldstone Report and other organizations. Knowing what you know, how does that make you feel? It makes me feel very frustrated to, to see the, the Goldstone Report and the, the reports about Israel is uh, very frustrating. And uh, knowing what we know on the plane, I wish I could uh, show them what, what, we, what we saw on the on cast lead. And um, I'm sorry they can't see. Squadron 100 flies at all times of the day, every day of the week. They say their goal is to have the targets picked out before the next conflict begins. <laughs> 